Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a um, custom PSP game boot. Alright, so first thing you want to do is you want to download the PMF tools uh, zip file from the description. And just right click and click extract here. <coughs> now this, this file um, I put together, um, it includes all the files needed to make an icon, an animated icon for a PlayStation 1 game. How to rip PlayStation 1 games and convert videos and a bunch of stuff. So open it up. And you have three things. First, you want to go to installers. Now, first thing you want to do is install gwave525.exe. So double click on that. Allow. Next, next, and finish. Alright, so it's going to start it up. Now go to options. And right it, uh, under the options menu, there should be um, a register option. I've already got mine installed and registered, but there should be a registered option. So click on register. Now back in the install folder, click on the text file, open it up, and it has all the user IDs and licenses for it. So just, I use this one, and that one works perfectly for me on my first try. So just pick one and use it. And once it's registered, just you can exit out of it. Now you want to run um, AVI Synth 258, and then just run that. Allow it. Agree. Next install. Shouldn't take too long either. Like next. Close. And finish it. Now click on. And now you want to run the audio convert. Run that. Just accept it. It's not there, just create it, just yes. Next install. Alright, so just I'm just gonna unclick all these because we don't need to run them at all. Not yet at least. Now, if you were going to um, take a PlayStation 1 game, you want to take the game right from the disc. You might want to run this program, uh, set up for clone CD. Um, mine's already installed. Got it right there. Mine's already installed. But if you're gonna be taking PSX, PS1 games and turning them into PlayStation PSP games, um, you might want to install that. Now, if you're gonna download videos from YouTube and you want to convert them so you can take, put them as a game boot or whatever, you want to run the YouTube converter setup. Just accept everything and just next it's not there install uh, just cancel and it no these all these installers shouldn't take too long um, So, if you launch it, just to prove it, if you launch it, it'll load up, it'll say this is just a trial version, and if you click try, now if you convert any YouTube videos, um, they'll be all, it'll have a watermark image, so if you don't want that anymore, open, uh, you want to copy youtubeconverter.exe, to copy that, now on the desktop, just open file location, and now just paste it in. And I just want to copy and replace. Alright, so now, just to show you, it doesn't give it doesn't have the uh, it doesn't have the the uh, register thing there because now you have the whole version. Now, if you have just any video you want to be able to convert it, you can install Exilla Soft HD Video Converter. This can convert videos to just about any format, um, iPods, PSPs, any format, you, any format you really want. Right, so, so just agree, install it, next, close it. Now click on the keygen, oops, that wasn't it, that was something else. Alright, so install it and everything. Okay, desktop icon, yes. Now that yours shouldn't take this long. 
but I've got the uh, CAM Studio program running. It's taking a little bit longer. Now, once it's all, it'll you'll get a desktop icon if you chose to have a desktop icon. See, right there. And once it's installed, you want to run the program. Click finish and make sure it's run. It'll say unregistered up here at the top. Go to just take a video, drag it in. That's not working. Just take any video and open it and just click convert. It'll convert it and right here. It'll say it's not registered. So back in the folder, this is the keygen.exe file. You want to run that, and it'll give you a registration code. Just it plays a nice little music. Just copy the name, paste it in, and the whole thing, right there. Copy all of it and paste it in. Now click register. You can exit out. Registered successful. Thank you for purchasing the product. Purchasing the product. And you can just stop that because you don't need it to convert. And you can exit out. Now you've got all your programs installed. Oh, oh forgot this one. Just run the PMF codex. You don't like next, 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 start. And no, I'm not going to run it. And exit. Now, there's one more thing that I put um, somewhere. Alright, right there. It's in the files, under files. You have ATRAC3 codex. Highlight all everything there and just copy it. Now open up wherever you installed Gold Wave. Just open file location and now paste everything in there. Yours you probably don't have already have it in here. But now this is to get the AT3 um, extension. So you can actually do that. Because I found out this is this is the only way I can get mine to work, and so it works every time, as far as I've heard. Now I'll click on the a track a track 3.inf and right click and click install, which I just did. Now you can exit out of Gold Wave. Now you have all the programs set up and installed. Now what you want to do is you want to get your video. My video is right here. You want it to be less than three seconds because this video I think is three seconds, just a little bit above three seconds, and I've made a game bit with it already, and it cuts off at the very end, and then the game just will start. So you want your video to be below three seconds, and if you want, you can have audio, but if you don't, that's fine too. All right, so now go on to the second part of the video.